Okay, hi. <laughs> this is a video for Melissa212. She's been emailing me asking about all the snow we get here in Sweden. And I thought I would make a video talking about it. So and I was, I was telling her about when it gets cold here, you can't start your car uh, unless you plug it in to the wall or something and because the engine is just too cold it won't start so you have to heat the engine with a little thing that's built into the car in this email she asks what do you do when your car is parked at work and that's actually usually no problem because since it gets so cold here um, you have these little stations or it's a kind of a little stick that sticks out of the ground and you can just plug your car into that and um, so people do that or if they don't know that they can I guess they don't use the car to get to work well if you're living in Jokkmokk and you work in Jokkmokk then you can walk it's not that big but otherwise you can just take the bus if you're worried but I would say there's no problem okay so the next question was about um, how did I do on my diet and I'm <laughs> I don't even remember having went on a diet for real I was like trying to but I think that when I get hungry I just tend to you know eat I haven't been thinking about it as much but I have been thinking that when I eat I should eat something that's healthy so I've been eating I actually have I've been eating the same thing over and over again and but I don't think that's a problem because well, I really I don't like cooking on a regular day I just want to you know if they made a pill that actually made you feel good about you know feeling full and everything and there was no downside to it I would probably be buying that and not eating and so <laughs> the thing I've been making is um, you buy these frozen vegetables you know broccoli and stuff and you just I just boil them and I put in some seeds and salt and well if I find some meat in the freezer um, so I guess I get all the nutrients that I need yeah, yeah and I put in some pasta or or noodles and yeah and I look at it and I think that this is all I need and I eat egg for breakfast so I don't think I need anything else and I don't think that's going on a diet because I eat I tend to eat I like to eat until you know I can't eat anymore and some I guess would call that binging but I you know I just you know so I've been on this philosophy that as long as what I'm eating isn't bad I can have whatever I want and I guess and I haven't been exercising so I don't I actually don't know I, I know I've lost weight but I don't know how <laughs> really and it might be because I go to the stable horseback riding but I mean it's just been summer and I haven't been all summer so yeah I don't know how that happened um, and I don't feel thin I just feel comfortable I, f I don't feel fat either so there shouldn't be a problem should there um, yeah and actually what I have been doing is knitting and such Okay, so <laughs> this is what I've been working on. 
<laughs> for a while now, um, for like a week. I don't, I don't know what it's going to be. I think it's going to be like a blanket or something you hang on a wall. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> and I don't think you lose weight doing that <laughs> because, you know, did you see a lady sitting around knitting and being really fat? Were you surprised? No. <laughs> Why would you? Um, actually, I didn't see that. I, uh, what am I talking about? Okay, this s video was supposed to be about snow. And actually, yesterday it snowed. Um, I wasn't happy about it because we just got this lovely autumn and I say lovely because you know all the colors and the trees and you know everything and I've been looking forward to that to that and um, because well I like summer but somehow my mind can't handle it being you know, daylight round the clock because I, I was born where there's nothing like that ever and I think my brain just can't it can't handle it so I I mean I didn't realize but first night when we were walking home and it was dark and I was like Look, it's dark, and I was filled with this happiness that I didn't know that I would feel. I was surprised, so I was like happy, and then all the trees got all the, all colorful, you know, yellow and red, and then we get snow. I mean, that makes no sense. We need the autumn part first. That's a thing about living here. I hate late autumn. And we don't have that here because you know I'm from the southern of Sweden. I say now, when I was living there, I would not say that it was southern Sweden, but now I think it is. Actually, well, anyway, you know, first you get all these colors in autumn, and then you know the leaves drop down from the trees, and you can they're all you know, the sounds when you like kick them around, <laughs> leaves, um, childish I know, but I love it, love it. But after that, the leaves that had fallen down to the ground, you know, they get wet and they're not fun anymore and they just get brown. Yeah, and then the trees aren't fun to look at when they lost their leaves, right? And and then, just, then we were just walking around and waiting for this wonderful thing that would come out of the sky, you know, snow, and make everything white and, you know, kind of happy. <laughs> and that period of time would be like awful. You know, it's cold and it's wet and it's grey and it's you don't have that period of time like at all here in Jokmok because you know you have your summer and it's really short I would like it to be a, a bit longer yeah and um, then you get the autumn and last year we had a long you know fall it was beautiful and just when you were starting to wonder well are is this going to go on for, you know, much longer? Not that I'm complaining because it's beautiful. Then we we got snow, and we were like, "Whoa, we got snow right now." Okay, <laughs> so that's no problem. But this year, I mean, we haven't had our autumn for like a week or something. It feels like, and and then we get snow. Yeah. So um, that's about it. <laughs> Please ask me more things about Sweden. Bye.